I know that women play a very important role in shaping the quality of lives in our communities, our state, and throughout the world. Yet we are underrepresented. On March 11, 2015, the Nevada System of Higher Education held its first ever Status of Women event at UNLV's Boyd School of Law. The Status of Women event was a way for system-wide for us to celebrate the achievements of women, but also take a pulse on the state of women in terms of where they're at in their careers, their economic mobility, the challenges they may face, um, but continually looping back to celebrating their successes too and finding a way to unite and you know, keep encouraging women to make advances. Dr. Adit Fernandez is Vice President of NSC's Office of Community Engagement and Diversity Initiatives. Dr. Fernandez and her staff were instrumental in planning this inaugural event. I thought it was a fantastic event. There were over 100 attendees. A solid 40% of those or more were from Nevada State College. So even though we're the smallest of the INCHI institutions, we had the highest representation. And we had the most men, which is important, because when you're talking about women's issues, men need to be at the table too. Keynote speaker and former Attorney General Catherine Cortez Masto is currently the Vice Chancellor of the Nevada System of Higher Education. More than half of the total number of students enrolled at NCHI institutions are female, 55.8%. NSC's female population is even higher, at 76%. Uh, I don't think Nevada State College set out to attract female students, um, but it's reflective of the demographics and probably the educational setting that we offer students where we've attracted women. So let's be intentional about serving these women, retaining them, and making sure they graduate. Nevada State Student Alliance Vice President Yesenia Cuevas is one of three students from various institutions who presented at the event. I am a first-generation college student, a Latina, a Pell Grant recipient. I will be the first doctor in my family, and I will be just another female to earn a bachelor's degree from Nevada State College. I think it's so important that students, who we all know are our future leaders, are at the conversation when we're talking about things that affect them. And we had a great turnout of students at this event today. As they reflect on the Status of Women event, key organizers all insist on one thing, the need to keep the momentum going. It came together rather quickly, and we're excited about just building on it from year to year. It's one day, but what do we do with the rest of the year? and continuing to be intentional about addressing the needs of women. There's so much you can do for your community if you just care enough to get involved. At the Boyd School of Law, I'm Yanae Givens with your NSC News.